To learn how I did this project, please visit my blog. The link can be found in the description box below. Hey everyone, this is Rukshika Rajkumar from Arduino Projects by R and today I am going to present you the second version of my Buzzwire game. This game has three modes. The first mode will be one life and the second mode will be five lives and the third mode will be time based which means you have to set the countdown timer and before the countdown reaches zero you have to finish the game and if this loop touches the maze your time will be reduced by two seconds now let me explain uh, what you'll be needing for this project uh, you'll be needing an Arduino Uno microcontroller board uh, you'll be needing two solderless breadboards uh, four plus and four uh, you'll be needing three push buttons this button will be used to change between the modes. Uh, for the first and second modes, uh, this button will be used to finish the game. Uh, once you finish the game, you can press this button and uh, the screen, the LCD display module will show you uh, your score. This button will be used to reset the game for the two, first two modes. For the third mode, this button will be used to set the countdown timer and once you've uh, set the timer you can switch it, uh, you can switch it off pressing this button again will start the timer and after you finish you can press this button again i have used the 10k potentiometer over here to set the countdown timer and uh, the analog valves will be mapped to the number of seconds and uh, i've programmed my arduino you know to do that you'll be needing a 16 by 2 lcd display module with i2c interface You'll be needing an active buzzer module, a red LED, 220 ohm resistor, a maze, a loop, and you can uh, make this maze and loop uh, by using some copper wire. And uh, you'll be needing some jumper wires. I have used some metal jumpers over here to reduce the usage of wires. And, uh, to prevent my setup uh, looking messy i have activated the internal pull ups for this button for this push buttons so that uh, they won't be needing the 10k ohm resistor for those of you who doesn't understand how this project works i'll explain you one end of this maze is connected to a digital uh, input port and this loop is connected to the ground so when this uh, loop passes through this maze and when the loop touches this maze there will be a conductivity and the circuit will be complete and this will uh, give a signal to the Arduino Uno microcontroller and with that signal you can program what uh, should happen in this game now let me show you how this works
Thanks for watching. Follow my blog and subscribe to my YouTube channel to stay updated with my latest projects and tutorials. Don't forget to comment, like and share.